everybody, welcome back to Mama Z's Texas Kitchen. Today, I'm gonna show you how to make hobo dinners, or foil dinners, whatever you might call them, in the air fryer. Be sure and like, share, and subscribe to my videos. And hey, give me a thumbs up. It helps the YouTube algorithm know that you like my videos. Let's get into the video. Okay, so here's what you're gonna need to make um, your hobo dinner, your foil dinner, whatever you want to call it. I grew up calling it a hobo dinner. You're going to either need steak, hamburger patty. I'm using a hamburger patty. You're going to put it in your, the center of your foil. Um, and this is the cool thing about it. If you're like me, my family likes totally different things. Well, my daughter and I kind of like the same thing. My husband does not. He if you've been around my channel very long, you know he's kind of a finicky eater. So, we're going to put some onions. I'm going to make his first. He likes onion and potatoes, some red potatoes. Alright. He likes a lot of onions, so I'll put quite a bit of onion on his. Alright. Some garlic. He likes lots of mushrooms. This is a great quick meal. Now, I'm making mine in the air fryer today, but you could totally do this in the oven, throw it on a campfire, however you want to do it. And then I'm going to season it with some Cajun seasoning, salt and pepper. And then I'm going to put a little bit of butter right in the middle. Now, you probably don't need a lot of butter um, because this has got, it's hamburger meat, it's got a lot of fat, so. I'm just putting a little bit. And then you're going to, you know, fold it. Fold it up like this. Okay. All right. Now I'm going to make mine. A little patty here. And I'm going to add on mine a whole lot more. I want onions. And some potatoes. I'm going to add some corn that I have canned. green beans that I've also canned. These are really fun to make with your kids because and it's a fun way to get them to eat vegetables. Uh, you could add broccoli, you could add whatever. Uh, and I'm leaving the mushrooms off mine. I like mushrooms, but I can take them or leave them. Salt, pepper, Cajun seasoning. Oh yeah, and let's not forget the garlic. We all agree garlic has to go on everything. And then just a little bit of butter. Because I mean, butter makes everything better, right? This has quality. Up. A 
add them in. Set this one over, and now I'm going to make Kendra's. And then Kendra, she wants onions. Carrots, potatoes, mushrooms, corn, green beans. Can you see how your kids would absolutely love making these? You could set up an assembly line and let each kid make their own little pocket. And then what my mom would do when we were little, she would take a pencil and write, just scratch in it, our initials. And then when it would come out of the oven, we'd be like, oh, that's mine, that's mine. And it was a fun game. Oh, I forgot to add Kendra's butter. All right, put Kendra's butter on top. And her seasoning. See, I'm getting ahead of myself. Pepper. Kendra wouldn't be real happy with me, would she? And her Cajun seasoning. All right. Now, I'm going to move you over here to the air fryer, and I'm going to show you what we're going to do next. All right, I'm going to put these in here. You're going to cook them on 400. I'm using the Power Air Fryer Pro, but you can put these on any air fryer that you have and the, the cooking would be about the same. Um, your temperature is at 400 for 25 minutes. Halfway through the cooking process, I'm going to come switch them out. Um, so I will bring y'all back and show you what they look like. See you in a little bit. Okay, so we're halfway through and I'm going to switch them around because it's the best way to kind of keep them cooking evenly. And they smell wonderful, guys. Okay, it's a little bit of extra work there, but I'm going to put this on the top shelf. I'll take this one and sit down on the bottom shelf. There we go. Close it back up, kick it for another 12 minutes, and then we'll be right back. All right, we are done. I'm going to take one out here. Open it up. This one's Keith's, or Papa's. All right, I'm going to bring it up to, a little closer to the camera so you can see it. Okay, my friends, here you go. Perfectly boiled dinner. This, these are so good and so easy. And when you can do them in the air fryer, why not? I hope you will try this video. Be sure and give me a thumbs up because that really helps me in the algorithm. Have you ever had a, a hobo dinner, foil dinner? Let me know in the comments below. I would like to know what you like in your foil dinners. Join me on the next video. Hope you have a good week.